Hey guys, this is Mike the Scrapper. This is some stuff I just received from a company that does gold refining. And uh, I want to show you what this stuff is. Now, this is a private video. If you're on Facebook, then you'll be able to watch this. If not, no one else will be able to. So, this is what I got first. This is called Sub-Zero. It's a nitric acid substitute for making aqua regia solution from muriatic acid. The second one, I think it's pronounced urea. It's used to adjust the pH in aqua solution. This, the other one here is called Storm Precipitant. There's a lot of stuff that goes on with these, and I'll explain to you when I start doing the video. This one is ammonia hydroxide. This is for testing the gold after I shrink it all with the uh, with the with the with the chemicals. And what happens is it turns into a mud that will test it to see if there's uh, still metal inside. And if not, we have to refine it again. But that's that again, guys. I'll show you in another video. And the next one is called precious metal detection liquid. This will tell me if there's any, uh, uh, like let's say chemicals still in the, uh, in the in the mud, just like the ammonia. All right, again, I'll explain more to you later. And uh, this is what we're gonna be stripping. All right, what we wanna do here is, with this stuff, we're gonna cut the fingers off and dip it in the solution. Again, like I said, I'll show you how to do that later. This is a lot of, memory chips here, a lot of um, RAM boards, but um, I'll show you how to do this one later. The next one is, is a whole bag of CPU chips. This is a lot of CPU chips, as you can see here. All right, just imagine all the gold that is in this and in the fingers, and then in some other stuff I'm gonna show you. You have Pentium 3 and two chips, that again, you have to cut, the, cut these fingers off. You have boards, uh, CPU chips like this one. Now look at that. That's all gold there. And if I can just get it around my finger, there's all gold in the back. When we're doing these chips, we have to smash this here because it makes the process faster. Green boards, green board CPUs. We're going to have to do a different type of solution. But, I, but to tell you the truth, I still think we can make it with, uh, with these regular boards. Again, these are th this is a 386 chip. The older the chip, the more gold in the chip. We have these uh, steel in the back. And here's another one. What we're gonna do with these, we're gonna try to do what they call reverse electroplating. So what we're gonna do is, we're either gonna take the steel off, and if we can't do it, we'll do reverse electroplating where these go in a uh, let's call it a uh, like a casserole dish and then we put in the solution we put in some other things and all the gold is going to be is going to start fizzing and it's going to go to what they call a cathode or a cathode it's going to go on there then we're going to be able to remove it from there test it refine it melt it sell it all right so this is pretty much the beginning and again guys i'll let you know once the video is up you guys will be the first to see it. All right, guys, this is Mike the Scrapper. Please comment, like, subscribe. Till then, guys, peace.